Guys, what's up and welcome back. Holy crap, what am I meant to do? How is everybody doing today? Jeez. So previously, started times for Adrian as Emma, you know, the therapist, told us that he is suffering from depression. Oh my god, like I feel so bad for him. Like I actually feel really, really goddamn bad for Adrian, but now we you just gotta do that kind of thing, like you just we just gotta, you know, do it. So let's read it. Um, hey DJ, I've been doing a lot of thinking recently, especially about Adrian and the challenges he challenges he's been facing. It's clear that he's been going through a tough time, and I believe it's crucial for us to be there for him. I know Adrian might not openly express his feelings, but I've sensed a change in his in him. It's important for us to go us to offer our support without judgment and let him know that we're here for him no matter what. I can't imagine what he's going through, but I want to be a pillar of strength for him during this difficult period. I've been researching ways to help someone dealing with depression, and I think it's essential for us to encourage Adrian to seek professional help. I, of course, am a pharmacist, but at the moment I'm booked up as majorly as possible. It's not about fixing him, but helping him find the tools to cope and heal. Additionally, I suggest we create a safe and non-judgmental judgmental space for Adrian to share his thoughts and feelings. We can organise casual get-togethers or activities where he might feel comfortable opening up. Sometimes just knowing that someone cares and is willing to listen can make a significant difference. If you have any thoughts or suggestions, please feel free to share. Let's make a positive impact in Adri's life. Therapist Emma. Whoa, I, I just don't know what to say. Like, like poor Adri, like, poor Adri, like. I feel really bad for Adri, like, really bad. But, you know, what can you do? He has depression. What's going to happen next with Adrian?